so this guy was having this tree cut down in town and there was honeybees in it and he tried to drown them with a garden hose and they had spray they were trying to spray so he came by the shop and asked me if I could do it well they had just cut the tree down and I found where the tree cracked and the tree cracked right right in there so I ratcheted and strapped the tree back together the best I could and I think I got everybody that I could save and I just cut their original hole open it was probably a 10 minute drive I was scared that they were not okay but they are wonderful bees that does my heart so nice to save them they've been through the ring or two poor girls but you guys are okay now I strapped them on the trailer and I brought them back baby um, but there's a lot of them in there I saran wrapped everything to keep everybody safe on the ride there's a lot in there unfortunately there are some that were already froze we're in November and they had froze that were on the ground last night uh, Danielle was afraid that this will sweat if I leave this saran wrap on so I will probably very carefully take the saran wrap off but I cut their hole this was their original hole that was way up in the tree and the tree trimmers didn't want to have anything to do with it I think everybody's okay. Look down in there. That's so cool. Hopefully the queen's in there. Very neat. Look at that. And they're nice bees. I think they're Italians. Let me see if I can get you closer. <laughs> uh, needless to say, I do not have a veil or anything. One. Easy girl. I, I, I leave you alone. I am just free, free handing her. <laughs> I'm gonna cut all this off. Leave the ratchet straps on because the tree split. Right there's where it split all the way across. And I actually ratcheted the strap everybody back in there. I mean, there's so much comb and everything in there. I think they will claim my ratchet straps for the rest of the winter season. I will not be taking them off because I think they're going to stay somewhat warm in there. Oh no! You're right, girl. You're okay. Let me get you out of there. Hold still. There you go. There you go. You're all right. That was a heck of a ride, wasn't it? Come on out. You're fine now. They tried to kill them. The tree trimmers tried to kill them. They had wasp spray out there and everything. And they're still alright. Man, it does my heart good. To save them. Save the bees. Save the bees. Without bees, we may not be. <laughs> I'm going to cut this off. I don't guess I'm going to. They're so nice. I'm not going to do any smoke or anything. Now they're angry. <laughs> they might not be nice right now. They're, they're angry. Stay back, Nee. You want to videotape Daddy getting stung? I think I will kind of cut some of this off. and I'll leave the ends. I don't want them to sweat. Even if it's like... Um, like we just got home, so they're still kind of shaking up. But if they sweat, saran wrap is the worst, isn't it? <laughs> Pretty cool, ain't it, Nee? Yeah. I see the honey. There's yeah, a lot of there's honey. a lot of honey in there. We're gonna let them have that this winter. They're gonna eat that this winter. They need it to make it through. And then this half. Yeah. Josiah robbed some when we were there. That was on the ground. Yeah, 
Here, stay back. I'm going to open this up. Oh, no. <laughs> That's the treasure. Maybe I should do smoke. That's the treasure. Oh, yeah. They're in there. <laughs> Get back, me. <laughs> they're, they're angry from the ride. All right, girls. Easy now. That's not far enough, me. Easy, girls. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Wow. See, I worry about them getting cold, though. Man, that is a lot of bees in there. Look down in there. That was in, that was in the tree. Look at that. That is cool. Starting to swarm us. This is my first, these are my first wild bees that I've gotten. My first wild bees. I've all for up till now I've just caught swarms and stuff. I think they're okay. Oh. <laughs> There's a lot uh, of them. Here's the treasure. <laughs> There's a lot of them, ain't it? Man, I absolutely love them. Let me get you a, let me get you a close in shot. Wow. How could you kill something like that? How could you kill God's most amazing animal? They do so much for us. Look at that. They are busy all the time. Yeah, I think they're Italian. And there's some young ones in there, too. I saw brood. Where's really the pretty brood. The young ones are in there. Oh, I see. See little ones? Yeah. They're very nice bees. I say that until <laughs> they come up and nail us. Come out of here and... Isn't that neat though? I'm just in awe of what God creates. Look at that. What what is that one doing? Oh, they're all busy working. Trying to probably trying to fix. I don't even want to think about the dead ones that's in there that when the tree come down and the killed smush. them. I know, it's sad, buddy. Daddy did his best he could to get them. Is that one okay? Yeah, come on. I know, he don't look okay. But hopefully the queen's in there and she's safe. Ooh. Yeah, they're going. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> my hair. Yeah. I'm going to open this the rest of the way up. Your mother thinks that we should do it like this. They're guarding the treasure room. Alright. Watch out. <laughs> Easy now, girls. I'm your friend. Oh, you're okay. You're fine. You're fine. You're all right, girls. Go ahead. Oh my goodness. What is that? That's dirt? It's part of the tree. Now I think they're going to be too cold. Maybe I'll block it off with something else. I think your mother's right. I think the saran wrap will sweat. Make them sweat in there. So, look at them in there. Wow. I think we need to put something at the end of this. Maybe I'll... <laughs> Maybe I oh, will. It's to pet nah, you can pet one if you want. Look at him in there. Man, that is awesome. Me, we don't have any veils on or smoke or anything. All right, we need to we need to do something for tonight. I don't want them to. I don't want them to get cold and freeze. But that's the way. That's the way I found it. On the ground, I had to break it off a little bit, but you can see where the tree trimmers cut and cut into honey, and they got a surprise. That'd sting you too if, I, if you were cutting into my home. <sighs> Saved them, knee. That's a, only a one time sting. <laughs> Alright, we gotta find something to block these holes off with. Because it's gonna get cold tonight. I don't quite know what to do, but. I'll find something. Maybe I'll stuff some rags in there or something, maybe. You know what I mean? That's the 
it's absolutely oh, amazing how they how they get in a tree. Yes. I know, buddy. Daddy, I know. That one's trying. It looks like he's Daddy trying tried to, to make it. All right, we gotta get to work. All right, I think I think we did good, knee. I used some of this foamy stuff and stuffed some really thick paper towels in there and I put some some it's not really insulation I think it's like flooring insulation stuff and I stuffed paper towels in there and I put that over top of it hopefully they'll stay warm in there Got the saran wrap off. I really don't want them to sweat because if we do have a couple warm days still. Yeah, they're having a funeral. Oh, they're having a funeral for the dead ones? <laughs> See that one that's sticky? Yeah, they'll carry the dead ones out. And have a little funeral. Easy now, girl. Alright. I ain't pretty. I guess I ain't getting my straps back because they're holding them all together. I'll get them back in the spring. Yeah, you can have some. That's good. Should I take it off? Oh, sure. You dip your finger down in there. Oh, oh somebody already dipped their little finger in here. I did. I did. Mm -hmm. I want to bite off it. That's wild, honey. The taste is more uh, waxy. Mm -hmm. Nope. I'm not getting my straps back. Because <laughs> if I unstrap it, the whole thing will come in too. Now, I guess the bees can have them. <laughs> and they can come out and get this stuff. They'll clean that up, I'm sure. And my bees might enjoy some too. They have to be friends, Nee. You think they'll make friends? Hopefully they do make friends. I think they'll make friends. Yeah, they, along with my children, the bees will enjoy that. <laughs> we'll leave it there for them to eat on. Hopefully they got enough. I think they got enough comb through the winter to make it. I'll feed them. I'll, I'll give them some food. Mix up some sugar water or something. Yep. I'll get those traps in the spring. <laughs> I ain't gonna try to find the queen. I guess I could try to get the queen and put her in a box and transfer it all like that, but I think they'll be all right like this. I think I'll keep an eye on them. <laughs> <laughs>